Well, it's Surf Church Sunday. I got the gear out in the street waiting for the guru. Guru's driving, me and the ring man. Tides are uh, bad. Tides already been passed, low tide by three hours. It's a, uh, I'm guessing it's a little afternoon, but I don't know for sure. We're headed to uh, hunt for some buttons. It's a beautiful day in the 50s. Can't beat it. We ha we couldn't stay home, so we're bound to the land of Nada. I got the uh, M9 with the big holes in it and the carbon fiber shaft for lightness. In the we're not going in the water or in the edge. We're gonna hunt up high. We'll just have to see how it goes. I guess. Some people have made comments about my nails. Well, this one was the least injured. You can see it's growing out good now. Just, just growing out. The other one was the one that took the blunt of the force in the window. And you can see it's gone now. It's actually, when it grew out to a certain point, it had an actual hole in it. And then later on, it just peeled right off and left the damaged nail to grow out on its own. It's a little hard button buttons with it, but it's a little tender right there on the end. But other than that, we're doing okay. Big Bowser. Stand by. You get up there early in the morning. It's as far get, west as you can go you can get the morning on the ocean front until you get to the fort. I think it might be, somebody said it might be a little chillier. Yeah. It's supposed to be a, a, a snow coming up. Tide is high. Right there, as far west as you can go. That's the Fort Story right there. Military base. There's a catamaran. He's locked in sand, ain't he? Stand by. Let's see what this uh, Fisher hat will do today. Mine lab detector and a Fisher hat. That's a hell of a combination. I was hoping to uh, see some whales here on the point. There's been a place has been inundated, inundated, inundated with whales of lately. All the boats going fishing have been watching whales everywhere. There's a big tugboat pulling a barge out of the bay. But there ought to be some whales out here today. My daughter's out here somewhere fishing. If I see any whales, I'll, I'll bring them up for viewing. Stand by. I got a piece of copper so far. One target. Better go up and check on the ring man. He's been in this one spot for an hour, just going up and down. He must have hit something. I don't know why he would be in all one spot all the time. But we get ready to find out. Stand by. What are you doing out here? You've been in one spot a long time. Uh, I got a little button. Button. Yeah. I don't think it's... Uh, Guru got a foreign, looked like a Russian coin, and another kind of coin. I got two pieces of copper and two pieces of aluminum and a pull, a pull top. I got a... I got a, a few, you got uh, plenty of copper around, it looks like. Ooh. 
round button thing that I don't see in there or not. Not in there? Well, I was looking at a nickel. Let me put this down. Yeah, hold it by hand. Yeah, I'll just dump the shit in there. Wait a minute, I ain't got no. Okay. There it is. Oh, yeah. Throw that in there, if you will. Yeah, some kind of button. It's got some sand packed in the back of it. I don't know if it's got a loop in it or not. I think the loop's missing. It's just a plane. Yeah, don't seem to be anything thing. on it. It's hard to tell though. Well, at least it's something. Better than what we see. We're making a move to a better location. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Between all three of us, we've got. Well, y'all got some coins. Hey, you got a coin. Oh, I got is copper. How much, say, how much you got? 89 cents, Danny? Uh, 81. 81 cents. You got a total of 81 cents? Yeah, I got a couple of coins. We're going to follow him close, Guru. A couple, yeah. couple of dimes, a nickel, and about six pennies. Stand by. We're going somewhere else. He ain't by Dylan Lombazon. Well, we moved down to our hot spot, 10th Street. You can see it's a beautiful day. We glider right now with this motel blocking the sun out, but lots of people out today. Everywhere. Stand by, we'll be on the beach in a minute. Well, I was gonna dig it up, but I said, hell, it's the only good sound I had all day. Look. Twelve fourteen, twelve fifteen. See what the heck that is. Naturally, it's got to be in China. Well, we got it out. Some kind of piece of copper looking thing. I got all I got today is copper. That damn CTX is locked in a copper mode. Building, I guess he wants a new building. We're headed home from the land of Nada. I mean, it looks like it's good for another 50 years. They sold all the stuff off of it. They had an auction back then. Yeah. Late summer. We got some kind of cool car just past us, an old car, antique plates on it. The damn sun's too bright right now, I can't show it to you. I don't know what it is, but it's cool. <laughs> is it purple or what? Yeah, it's it purple, dark purple. There it is in the rear view mirror. Well, we might as well crack these wussets from the bay the other day. We, a couple trips on the bay, we got some wussets. Because we know that one right there is a spark plug. But we don't know what the rest of them are. So stand by, let's see what we got. Well, one was a nut.
One was a spark plug of some nature, some type. The other one was a spark plug. I forgot about that. It had this ring around it. Spark plug ring. Oops. One of them was a... I don't know if that was a nail at one time or what it was. And the other one was a big nut with a bolt. The living end. I don't know what tomorrow's going to be. But if we go, we're going to go on the bay if the weather let us. We'll find some more watches, maybe. Okay, see you later.